What is up you guys? It's your girl Terry and today I am back with another YouTube video. If you are a new viewer to my channel, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you turn on your post notifications so you can know when I post. And if you are a returning viewer, what's good? What's up? How you doing? I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. As you guys can see from the title of this video, we are going to be doing something a bit different today. I am going to be sharing with you guys my skincare routine, my nighttime skincare routine for a clear skin skin you guys so I'm really excited to share this with you guys because I know a while back I told you guys about how I had a really really bad breakout and I just wasn't on social media because that breakout was just too bad for me so now I'm just going to share with you guys how I keep up my skin after I got it back to normal and let me put a disclaimer out there that my skin is not perfect. It's been going through its little challenging times because I haven't been taking a lot of care with it how I should after all this makeup, but it is still very, very far from where it used to be. And yeah, y'all. Um, so basically, I'm going to be sharing you guys, sharing with you guys what I do after a long day of wearing makeup and, you know, recording and sweating, how I get my skin back to normal. So if you guys are interested in that, definitely stay tuned, stay tuned to this video and let's get right to the video. This video is going to be sponsored by Duval and I am going to be using my spin care system by Duval in this video. So it is an amazing product you guys. I'm going to make sure I put the coupon code in the description box down below so that if you guys like this spin brush, um, when you see it in the middle of this video, you can purchase it and you can get 70% off of your order. And my coupon code is Terry. Once again, it's going to be in the description box down below for you guys. But let's just get into the first step. So the first thing obviously is to take off my, my, you know, my jewelry because we don't need our jewelry to be messing up. You feel me? Like, uh-uh, we need this. I don't take off these earrings until I actually go to sleep, to be honest, because it'd be too many. But the first thing that I do is I know that makeup wipes are not all that good for the environment, but I use them because I had a lot and I need to get rid of them. But I do plan on changing um, my, like, take off makeup routine once I run out of these make these makeup wipes so the first thing I'm gonna do is take my lashes off oh I don't look pretty anymore I'm just kidding everybody you're beautiful you're beautiful with and without makeup the first thing that I'm gonna do is take my wipe and basically wipe off as much makeup as possible and me I do a three-step cleansing process when I am taking off my makeup because I literally want to make sure it's all gone I use a makeup wipe first then I use my um, cleansing water and then I actually wash my face so that's just what I personally like to do because I want to make sure everything is off of my face okay because I ain't gonna lie I had my times where I used to just and that was horrible for my skin and I didn't know that and I will wake up in the next morning with makeup still in the crevices of my face so let's just wipe this makeup off All right, y'all, so this, I only use one makeup wipe, but like I hate when people use like two and three makeup wipes to take off their makeup. You literally only need one. And just so you guys know, the makeup wipes I use are these by Neutrogena. I actually love these. I tried other ones before and I always resulted back to these. So these are my go-to. And yeah, I only use one. As you guys can see, this is basically like most of my makeup. Remember, I'm gonna go in with another cleansing system and um, get, go to the next step. So next, I like to take these um, cotton pads. Oops. I like to take these cotton pads and I get these from Target, but you're gonna see these from almost anywhere. And I just use basically one of them. And I take, I take my, micellar cleansing water and I pour it on the cotton pad as much as possible and I go in and cleanse my face with this. One of the things that I absolutely love about micellar cleansing water is that you can put this near your eyes and clean your eyes and it doesn't burn. So I really, really like that about this. So you could get all up in the crevices of your eyes and get that eyeliner that's just be left right there because you can't really get it. This does a really, 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 really good job with getting that eyeliner. And the one that I use is by Garnier. Gone, Garnier skin active 
All right, let's go. So as you guys can see, this is a really, really important step in my skincare routine, because especially when I'm removing makeup, because you see all this makeup on the makeup wipe and you think, okay, I got it all off. But look at this, look at that. So much makeup that was left on my face that the wipe did not remove. So that's why I like to go in, ooh, look at that all in my edges. That's why I like to go in as many times I do with cleaning my face because I literally want to make sure that everything is gone. Literally everything. Okay. So now that we went in with our micellar water and a makeup wipe, we're going to finally get to the actual face washing portion of my skincare routine. And for my face wash, I do use something that is prescribed by my dermatologist. And it's because when I was actually fighting acne, I couldn't find a soap that works for me. So I decided to go the dermatologist route. I do use um, sodium, sodium sulfatimid. And this is basically another strand of sofa cleanse. So you guys may have know of sofa cleanse, but this is basically, I forgot what they call it, like a generic brand, generic, something like that. It's a, it's, it's the same um, like ingredients that's used in sofa cleanse. And the name brand that I use is by Acela Pharmaceuticals. And I really, really like this stuff. Like I've tried other soaps instead of this one because I definitely know that sulfur is really, really harsh for the face, but I've tried to use other soaps and they do not like clear my face up as much as this do. But because my face has been mostly clear and when my face is pretty much clear, I don't want my face to get completely used to this. So in the morning, I will go ahead and use my Cetaphil just for a harsher cleanse, I mean a lighter cleanse. And in the night, I go in with Sofa Timid to actually like really, really, really give my face a good, good treatment. So yeah, let's just go in with this. And we're actually gonna be using our spin brush um, for this. So this is how the spin brush comes. And it has um, different type of exfoliators. And it also has a big one right here, which is for um, your body. Basically is for deep exfoliation cleansing of your face. I I personally only use my spin brush twice a week because I don't like to exfoliate my face every single day because I don't feel like that's good. So I use my spin brush twice a week. My favorite brush for the skincare system is this one. I don't use the other exfoliating one because I personally feel like that is too harsh for my skin, but I definitely feel like this one gets the job done perfectly. So that is the one that I'm gonna be using for this video. One thing that I also wanna mention is that the Duval skincare system takes four AA batteries. So just so you know, you're gonna need to get AA batteries. But I like to go in with I'm so sorry, but I do need to mention this for everybody who's gonna try to come at me. I did wash my hands before I start recording this video, so it is important to make sure you wash your hands before you start cleaning your face. Let me put that out there. But my next step is to go ahead and apply lukewarm water on my face because with the sofa timid, you're supposed to apply it with water on your face, on a wet face. So normally, if it's a regular day, I will wash my hands, I wash my face with my hands, but because I'm using my skincare system today, I am going to be using the skincare brush. And I like to put like a little squirt right here, a little squirt on my forehead, ugh, and one on my cheek, like that. So, and I make sure that I do not let the pump touch my face because there's all type of germs in my face, especially because I just took off makeup. So now I'm just gonna go in with my skincare system. I'm gonna wet it a little bit and I put it on the lowest setting and I'm just gonna go in and start cleaning my face. And the thing that I like about the Duval Spin Care System is that the brush is very, 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 very gentle and super, super fragile. So you don't have to worry about too much harsh scrubbing on your face that can possibly cause your skin to get irritated or become over exfoliated. So I really, really, really love this brush. So I just go in with this for about 30 seconds. 
to make sure my face is getting as much cleansing as possible and as I stated to you guys before I like to go in with three care cleansing system because as you can see my brush is still taking off even more makeup than I already had on and that's one thing that I like about this brush it literally gets all the dirt all of the dirt and my face is starting to get a little bit dry so I'm gonna go ahead and wet the brush a little bit just to loosen up the soap there we go So I kind of just wait for this to dry all over again. And once it pretty much dries to the point where I can barely see it, I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it all off with lukewarm water. Um, one thing that I did wanna mention is the reason that I use lukewarm water is because I don't believe in that whole thing where people be like, oh, warm, I mean, hot water opens up your pores and like, lukewarm water, I mean, cold water closes your pores. Like, I don't really know if that's true or not. So, I just use a lukewarm water. So, I feel like my face has gotten pretty much a good cleansing after this and my makeup work and my, 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 I mean, my makeup white and my micellar water. So, I'm gonna go ahead and be done with my skincare system. But, you guys, this product is absolutely amazing. I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend you guys check this out. I'm gonna have all of the links in the description box down below. A cute, uh, including my coupon code so you guys can get 70% off if you decide to purchase this. And also remember that this is something you can use for your body as well with the bigger brush. I also wanna make sure that you guys do not use this again before you clean it. All this dirt in this, you do not wanna put this on your face. So I'm just gonna already start. You wanna wash it off. You feel me? Okay, let's move on to the next step. So now I am going to go ahead and wash the water off of, I mean, I'm sorry, wash the soap off of my face. And one thing that I do want to say before I do that is I like to use um, rags to dry off my face, but the catch is I change my rags every single day. Every single day I use a new rag because I do not want any of the old bacteria to clog my pores or make me break out, so I change my rags every single day. As you guys can see, I just want to get a new rag because this is a new rag. So let's get this washing. So I definitely like to pat my face dry because when you rub it, that is just too harsh for your skin. To, personally, it's too harsh for my skin. So I do a lot of patting to dry my face rather than rubbing. And rubbing also pulls out my nose piercing. So I just prefer to pat, pat, pat. Y'all see my edges is messed up. Ooh, let's hold up. Let's fix this one. Fix this one. And now we gotta wash the hands because we don't fix this whoop. You know, I still gotta look cute for the video. Ooh, yeah. I do also want to mention that if you guys didn't notice, if you're one of the girls who love to wear your edges all swooped on your face, make sure that when you are cleaning your face, you get up in there because we always love to leave makeup in our edges and that is no way, shape, or form good for your skin. So now, the next step in my skincare routine is to go in with my Epidural Forte, which is another that I got prescribed from my dermatologist. However, adipoline gel and benzoyl peroxide is something that you can find over the counter now, just at a lower percentage. So mine is at a 2.5, and mine is at a 0.3 slash 2.5%, and I think it's a little bit lower if you were to get it over the counter. So I like to just do a pump here, a pump here, a pump here, and a pump here, and another one there, okay? I can't find the top. Here it is. And the purpose of adipoline gel is basically to get rid of hyperpigmentation. So I did have a lot of hyperpigmentation. You could kind of see a little bit right there, but it's like almost completely gone because I've been using adipoline gel for some time now, for a really long time. And it definitely works. It does take a little longer to work, but once it works, it literally like is a miracle, okay? I just rub it in all over my face. I don't do spot treatment, honestly. I know some people do spot treatment with adipoline gel, but I prefer to just rub it all over my face like that. And I believe that's the way my dermatologist told me to use it, if I'm not mistaken. And I only use adipoline gel at night. So usually, I kind of just let this dry for a little while, because at first it's wet and then it dries, like very like matte feeling, and like makes your face really dry. 
so I like to just dry it, you know. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm just touching myself. I'm not used to recording, so I'm not used to how I look. But let me just wash my hands. Oh. So now I am going to go in with another treatment. And I am using niacinamide 10% and zinc 1% from the brand The Ordinary. I recently just discovered The Ordinary when I was going through my whole bre breakout. And I absolutely love their niacinamide product. And it's just amazing. So niacinamide definitely like regulates um, sebum and minimizes your pores. So that is why I use niacinamide. And I just be feeling like it just be making my face look so vibrant. It's just so bright and nice and pretty. So I love using my niacinamide. Once again, this is how the bottle looks. It's a really cute, simple glass bottle. And I just spray a little bit here. I do the same thing. Do not let the syringe touch my face because God knows where my face been at and we don't need no bacteria getting into the formula. I just go in and kind of pat that in my face. I don't rub this in. I like to pat it in. Give my face some nice slaps. Some nice slap, 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 slap. Just fight your face a little bit. You guys can see how it's like very creamy. It'll be eventually dry though. So that is how my face looks after I put my niacinamide on my face. And you guys can already see the difference. At first it was like super dull looking. And just with the niacinamide, I just feel like it made my face look so much brighter and just hydrated. I love niacinamide so, so much. Literally like when you guys are looking for skincare products, Look and see if the product has niacinamide in it because niacinamide is amazing. Not amazing, amazing, okay? So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to moisturize my face. Moisturizing is really, really important for me because I do have combination skin and a lot of places on my face will get really, really dry if I don't moisturize and it's not a good feeling at all. So I like to go in with the Aveeno Clear Complexion Daily Moisturizer. This one has salicylic acid in it um, and it is a toner, tone corrector as well. So I don't use toner because this toner is a really unnecessary stuff in your skincare routine, okay? If you want me to just be real. So I'm just gonna go in with two pumps on my hand like that and I'm gonna rub it in and just kind of pat this in as well. The last and final step for me at night is to go in with an oil treatment for my face. I don't use a bunch of serums on my face because I'm really, really prone to breakout. I'm also really, really, really prone to fungi, acne, and if my face gets too oil, it'll clog my pores and cause me to get those bunch of little bumps all over my face. So there is only one oil that I use on my face and it is 100% squalane oil, not squalene, squalane oil. Oil. and I love to put this on my face just for um, you know a extra hydration in my face you know us girls like to have all our serums and oily face when you go to um, sleep so this works well for me and it does not cause me to break out and it's just whew, I love this stuff so much so I just put a little bit in there and I used the brand um, timeless FYI I got this from Amazon and it was like ten dollars pretty cheap I like to use two or three pumps three because if you use too much of this face you gonna be looking walk around like you put chicken grease on your face Right, you guys so that is basically the end of my night care skin routine for clear skin as you guys can see my skin looks really really nice super hydrated just not you know I'm not saying my skin is perfect but it looks healthy and nice and hydrated and this is what I do to keep my skin nice you know and healthy at night after all of the makeup and stuff that I had on I know that my skincare routine is not not that crazy but I like to keep my skincare routine as simple as possible because I believe simple is better and I don't think my face reacts well to having a bunch of different products like packed up on my face a little too oily under the eyes you feel me yeah 
so I don't do like toners and like eye creams and all that it's just like my face is just mm -mm. I like simple simplicity um, I definitely encourage you guys to go ahead and purchase your skincare brush I definitely encourage you guys to go ahead and purchase your Spin Care System from Duval. This is absolutely a game changer. It's like one of the best skincare um, systems, like skin, skin care, spin care systems that I have used in a really long time. I had another one and it was just way too harsh for my face. So this one is super duper perfect. The speed of the brush is amazing. It's not too fast where it's like peeling your skin it's amazing but I definitely do notice the difference in my face after I exfoliate with my spin care system from Duval so all of the information for that is going to be linked in the description box down below but anywho thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on your post notifications so you guys can know when I post and I will see you in my next video bye <laughs>